Hey yo, good morning MK Gang. What's up? How's everyone doing? Welcome back to another freaking vlog. Oh my god, it's 29th. It's actually the 29th of December. Bro, this is so sick. Everything's moving so fast. I don't know why everything's moving so fast. This is actually kind of annoying me. I'm like, bro, I just want to vlog. You know what I mean? I just want to vlog. I just, imagine just vlogging forever. Imagine there was no end to the year and you just had to like... Bro, that I look at it is. Like, it's like there's no difference in the year. You know what I mean? Like, it's not like... Everyone still goes through the same phase where it's like, you're new me. But then there's like a lot of people that don't actually change that and like, they're just like, oh, new year, new me. I'm gonna do this. But I as the year goes on, they start to get more lazier and lazier. So they're just like, ah, I'll do it next year. New year, new me. So that's all like, that's what I've seen a lot of. Well, I don't know, maybe there's people out there that actually do stuff. I don't know, maybe someone out there is just like, for this year, I'm gonna get in shape. Yes, I'm gonna do that, I'm gonna get in shape. And then they actually go out and do it. Bro, respect, respect. And then you have those people that are like, new year, new me, and then they get lost halfway through the year, and then they just don't bother. Or like first two months in, they're just bored. So they just go back to their old self. So not really sure what you mean by new year new me you know what i mean you know you know um but yeah obviously this year is coming up and it's going to be a new year new me so uh <laughs> no i do have uh, i do have a lot of big stuff planned for next year anyway so like it's there's a um a lot of big goals planned so uh um, yeah i don't know um I, some of you guys um i don't know like i don't really like i don't really like like living off goals because i'm like i'm more of a like a visionary type person so like some of my goals if i was list them off some of you'd be like bro you're crazy it's like when I wrote down the three albums, like people were like, three albums? Yeah, okay. We done that. <laughs> Dab, tick off. And then obviously I wrote down two movies, but obviously you guys are happening with all that stuff now. So yeah, um, it's just, it's just about, it's like, it's about setting those bigger goals. The smaller goals everyone do, bro. If you're setting small goals, which everyone can do, it's not really the challenge, you know what I mean? It's not really the challenge. So I like to set those bigger goals. I like to set those bigger freaking goals, bro. You know what I mean? Set those bigger goals. They're just sick. It's just it's really nice. It's really nice. Oh, something I forgot to do actually is make chicken. I normally make chicken. I forgot to make it today. Um, I don't even know if I have chicken. I don't even know if I got chicken. I, 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 I'm, 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 there is one thing I've got really lazy with, and that's working out. Um, I used to work out like six days a week. Then I went down five days, and then during like May and June, started to go down to like three days. Um, but I was doing like three days, and I was doing like full body workout in those three days. So I suppose maybe it was okay. And also it gave me time for my muscles to repair so probably a bit better and I wasn't like on energy ache all the time and I don't know a lot of goals bro a lot of goals I need to fix this I'm, I'm, I'm working on it I'm working on it okay I'm working on it next year's gonna be good next year's gonna be awesome it's gonna be it's gonna be really nice it's has to really gonna merch. Uh, link in the description awesome this is my main problem this whole hair situation this is my main problem when it grows really long and I've also just worked out and I've sweated or when I'm doing like some cardio stuff I just my hair is everywhere I don't know where it's everywhere but my head if i'm being honest which is weird but yeah um doing some cardio or not doing any well i am doing cardio walking is cardio doing some dope stuff tonight at 3 a.m is gonna be dope but i'm gonna explain it to you guys anyway so uh don't get your hopes up. it's not gonna be great <laughs> just joking it's gonna be savage that's freaking merch link description get stuff some it's freaking dope well today is very interesting because i have come back from my walk now and currently just standing here in the uh in the living room as you'd say the living room by the way just a small reminder it is the 29th of December, which means there's two days left this year. Two freaking two, two, two freaking days left in this year, and I will not ever be standing in this room again. Can we just take that all in? Like, I don't think any of you guys realize, but you guys will never see this room again. Never, ever, bro. That's sad. That's so sad. You know, that's so sad. You know, I, you know, it's really sad. You know, you know, you know. Two more days, and we're never standing here again. So sad. But yeah, I'm gonna do something tonight. Um, I'm sure you guys can guess what it is by the obvious title and the title. Well, obviously you guys can guess it from the title and thumbnail. Has freaking merch in the description. Get so some freaking dope, bro. It's awesome. I dab. Anyway, moving on. I'm, I just brought back the dab. <coughs> <coughs> But yeah, uh, we're literally doing a uh, 3M challenge today, so I hope you guys are ready for that one. I'm really ready. I'm super ready. I can't freaking wait. It's gonna be awesome. It's gonna be delicious. It's gonna be smash like subscribe. It's gonna be deadly. It's gonna be so freaking cool, bro. So cool. So cool. Awesome. That's freaking merch link in the description. Get yourself some. Let's wait till 3M, I suppose. <laughs> well, welcome to the My Hair is Awful show. How are you doing? I'm your host. You may remember me from such movies such as I haven't released a movie this year. <laughs> 
because I didn't do one. I don't know why that's so fun. That's not even fun. Whatever. Okay, so it's currently 3 a.m. Now, you guys know I done this a few days ago where I reacted. Excuse me, phone. I done this a few days ago where I. Excuse me, phone. I done this a few days ago where I reacted. Is it gonna do it? Is it gonna do it? No, it's not. I done this a few days ago where I reacted to. Really? Seriously? God damn it. I done this a few days ago where I reacted to. Uh, I done this a few days ago where I reacted to uh, scary ghost stories. Ha. <laughs> gotcha. So, yeah. Um, a few days ago, I reacted to a guy called Nukes Top 5. If you guys don't know who it is, make sure she goes subscribe. Nukes Top 5 is probably one of my most favourite, like, person that put videos together. Obviously, he doesn't make the videos himself, like. That's why I like Mr. Nightmare, because he actually tells the story. But I know he doesn't write the stories, because he gets people that have had the experiences to write the stories. And with this, with Nukes Top 5, seriously, phone. With Nukes Top 5, he, he's basically getting scary videos from other YouTubers. And last time we watched finders keepers seekers peepers or i don't know what it was to be honest but yeah so yeah that was number five and um, today we're gonna watch number four um it was something weird it was something like afraid of tiktok or something so this is gonna be interesting um you guys know i'm a tiktoker now so you know make sure you go follow me on tiktok link in the description as usual astro you can merch link in the description oh my god sick dope astro you can merch link in the description bro what's cracking what's cracking huh what? i was about to take i was about to take a drink until i realized that i brushed my teeth so i'm not gonna i'm not gonna take a drink sorry don't mind me i'm just really weird i don't like taking a drink of i don't like drinking anything after i brush my teeth like anything like diluted or anything i don't like drinking i don't know maybe i'm just weird but yeah um moving on we're going to react to some scary freaking videos so i hope you guys are freaking ready because i know i'm not <laughs> once again we're back at 3 a.m i think i've already said this but yeah we're back at 3 a.m right what is all these video or what are all these notifications that i'm missing here because this is going to annoy me because i just keep getting them now and it's like really ridiculous okay that was a that was a really waste of time oh my god i can't even skip what's going on okay there we go wow anyway moving on let's get into it let's do it right here we go this is called what is this called okay so this is called meanwhile on tiktok right are you guys ready three two one Deepers. boom meanwhile, meanwhile on tiktok tiktok, TikTok user chips, chips and chicken, chicken shared a strange mm. video she explains that the video was captured by CCTV late at night in the 50-year-old building of a union center in California. One night, something triggers the building's alarm. So the office manager goes to check the CCTV footage. He finds a truly chilling discovery that as TikTok user hey. Chips and Chicken put it, quote, freaked hey, him out. Have I seen this? Oh, what is that? This looks like she's floating, Bob. Oh, God, that gives me a Oh, no, that freaks yeah. me out, man. A white figure can be seen hovering around the back of the building. Workers who watched the footage believe it might be the spirit of a Union Center member who had recently passed away. TikTok user Chips and Chicken is baffled by the footage. She says that all of the men who work in this building are elderly and simply wouldn't know how to fake something like this. That's so, cool is it real? Or is it just an elaborate hoax? I still think it's maybe you a hoax. TikTok user, your mom's undies. <laughs> Let's just take a second for the giggles to pass. All right. Uh, anyway, she claims that she is usually unaffected by anything scary that she watches on the internet or TV. But when her uncle sent her this video captured at his apartment in Milwaukee, Wisconsin, she was shocked. Zombies. I love this dirty footage. Mm. No, man. No, man. The family claims that they have been tormented by frequent paranormal activity for the entire four years that they have lived in this apartment. But they say they've never captured anything like this before. No. What terrifies the family no, even more no, is that the dark no, figure, no. which appears to have claws for no. hands, can be no, seen coming out of their sleeping I baby's bedroom. I have goosebumps. When they received the notification of captured movement caught by their security camera, no. they say they immediately fled no. the apartment to stay at their parents' home. So did the family capture some dark entity on camera? That's and decide to wake the dead. 
Popular Jordanian livestream ghost hunter Hassan Barbar is back with Hassan another terrifying Barbar. investigation as he travels to an abandoned mm -hmm. house in the middle of nowhere. The house is said to be haunted by a dark spirit or jinn. As Hassan explores, he records everything live for his Snapchat followers. Soon, he begins to hear a very chilling sound. Allah, Allah. Bismillah. Just press the thing. Hey, hey. Oh, man. Hey, hey, hey. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. في حد بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم بسم الله الذي يضر مع اسمه شيء في الأرض في السماء والسميع العليم بسم الله الله أكبر بسم الله الله أكبر. Hassan sees a dark figure peeking out from the door of the abandoned house. As it darts back inside, Hassan runs to the building, but the figure has disappeared. But whatever is roaming the property seems to be getting even closer. No, I can't do it, man. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Bismillah. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. A'udhu bi kalimati Allah al-Tammat musharri ma khalaq. Yee, bi yee. Bismillah, Bismillah. Bismillah. Bismillah, Allahu Akbar. Again, Hassan runs as fast as he can, only to find nothing. He's beginning to get a little spooked, but he continues on, him. and then things get downright chilling. The terrifying scream becomes ear-piercingly loud and Hassan once again attempts to run toward the source of the sound, but he painfully stubs his toe against a piece of cement. The room appears to be completely empty as Hassan checks his injured toe. Then out of nowhere, the intense screaming is back and now it seems to be right where he's standing. Hassan is frightened but keeps filming for his live stream audience. That's when things take a terrifying turn. I watch it. I can't watch it. I'm so scared. As Hassan looks out a window, he gets hit in the neck by something. As he points the camera towards himself to show his injured neck, a horrifying dark figure suddenly appears right behind him. Terrified, he turns around, but again, there's no one there. That's when Hassan has finally had enough. He decides to just get out of there. I'm terrified. I did not want, like, I, you guys literally see my reaction. I'm, I, I, I didn't even speak. I don't know what to say. I'm like so scared now. I'm like, bro, I'm so scared. I know I'm going to need to go for a pee later and I'm not going to go. I think I'd rather pee in my own bed. Like, no joke. But yeah, guys, I'm going to end off this freaking vlog because it's actually running very long. It's been running for 15 minutes. So yeah, I'm going to end off this vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed. I love you guys. MK gang, like and subscribe. I'll see you guys tomorrow's freaking vlog.
that terrified the life out of me. Usually rhyming is where you can find me. Ain't no wrong team, but the crew behind me. Fake friends kill me, but the truth revive me. Winning despite the fact you despise me. All I do is rep the homies, homie. I don't listen to birds, you gotta show me.